Good day, my fellow sim friends. This is the start of a brand new video series on my channel where I'm going to explore the deep water of eye racing, starting from the absolute bottom of the sea, which is of course the well-known Rookie series. From the Rookies, I will share my journey upwards the shallow waters of the A-Class license. The whole reason I'm doing this is because I talked with some sim racing friends who are well equipped, gear speaking, you know, uh, all that fanatics, sim cube, sim magic, housing veld, whatever premium shit, and claim that it is almost necessary to have that stuff to be able to compete at a higher level. Uh, no, I was immediately triggered to show that all of that premium shit isn't needed to be able to reach higher levels of eye racing or racing in general, because you know, I'm just a sim racing enthusiast that spends most of his money on his yeah, wife and children, of course. For a good understanding, I have a desk mounted wheel, the T300, an office chair on wheels from IKEA, where I take the back wheels or, or I, I take the back wheels out to avoid rolling backwards, and an old 43 inch TV screen with a mind blowing 40 millisecond delay at 60 Hz. So without wasting any more time, let's go to racing, since I signed up a couple of minutes ago, as you can see. And of course, you would help this channel a lot by hitting the subscribe button and putting your notifications on, so you don't miss any of the new content that will be released every week. Okay, I'm gonna take a start at the pits, just to be sure. I'm not getting screwed by anyone. This fastest way to get out of those uh, series, I think. So, all right, let's go. I'm trying to gonna catch up with those guys. Won't be too hard, I guess, since. Uh, yeah. Okay, they crashed. Be careful. Okay. Now they crashed head. Whoa. Oh, damn. Ah, I hit the guy. Did give me, ah, it didn't give me any penalty. Oh, the light bump. So you see, start is already chaotic. <laughs> Alright, let's have a go. Let's see if I can get... Oh, he bumps me twice. Still no penalty. Oof, I'm lucky there. <laughs> what a start. <laughs> oh, what a start. <clears throat> All right. Let's see if I can catch the next one. Looks good. It's always like that in the rookies. Didn't expect anything else. That's why I start from the pits. I don't want to get hit the very first time. And you know, then your race is already wasted and you need another race to just get. Whoa, where's that guy going? I managed to save it on the grass. And another one. Yeah, okay, great. So we're up in 8th place now. With taking minimal risks, just avoiding everything. Alright, nice and tight, nice and tight. Okay. Now I've got quite some distance to cover now, so. We'll see if someone else makes a mistake. catching up so should be doable I think to oh, that was close on the grass <laughs> now if you hit the grass it's like ice skating it's really hard to control your car okay oh some more smoke there you go the guy I thought I would catch 
makes it easy for me. And I'm in fifth place. Okay. Time for the next one. Hernando, I'm coming for you, man. Or at least I hope to. Low 55s. Every round, so quite okay. With my crap setup, remember? But okay, I don't expect the rookies to be a series where I'll spend more than 3 4 races and if I'm careful not to crash into anything. Should be able to jump to the D license pretty quick. Uh, there's one behind me that's pushing. Yo, that was close, man. <laughs> ah, just hitting that pit curb just gave me a penalty. Jesus. Oh my god, the guy just dive bombed me out of the corner. <sighs> yeah, well. It was already close last corner and now he just... It hits me like very hard in the back okay I can't adjust my braking depending on what the guy behind me is gonna do <coughs> too bad for the first race to start like this let's hope I can keep my penalties as low as possible because yeah that's the only downside in i racing you get penalty points if someone else makes a mistake so let's just make the best of it try to get back Yep, there they go. Make it pretty easy. Oh, stay on the... Wow. <laughs> that was a close gap. Jesus. I... I guess this guy's all drive without mirror. I mean, Jesus Christ. They crash and the first thing they want to do is get back on that racing line as fast as they can. Look the guy that just crashed in me. <clears throat> That's just terrible. I do have a history with uh, ACC, so... It's not my first race experience online. But yeah, even in ACC it's just the same thing. They just keep on dive bombing you because they want to make an impossible pass or they don't count in the fact that you're gonna break on your break point so they have to break earlier uh, but instead of that they just break at the same break point so they just crash into you which just pushes you out of the track of course Yeah, we'll see how it goes. I mean, 
is a rookies. So if you're trying it yourself, don't uh, freak out or get frustrated. There's a reason it's called rookies. Come on, you can do it. Well, we're halfway almost. Let's see what we can do. Oh, break a little late there. Yeah, just lost a bit of time. Would be cool to catch him. I don't know if I will. I'm trying. Come on! A piece of garbage MX5. Which is an awesome car to drive, really. Ah, oh, yeah, of course. <sighs> I'm not gonna learn it, will I? Jesus, I just hit that damn curb again from the pits. I'm coming for you. Yeah, he's white there. He's white, yep. Sliding again, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Trying to see if I can force him to make a mistake. Yep, oh, he left the door open. Nice. Thank you, man, for not shutting it half corner side to side. And the other guy, 12 seconds, yeah, okay. If I don't make any more mistakes, this will probably be my finishing position. And as you can see, it's done from the pits. So it's perfectly possible to start last from the pits with delay and then without really racing. Just uh, waiting on others mistakes to just finish sixth. I think... Uh, If I wouldn't be dive, if I wouldn't have that dive bomb, I'd probably be closer to the guy that's at 11 seconds now, and I could could be driving for fifth or fourth. 
Okay, yeah. Unlucky there. Almost done. Three quarters done. Last quarters to go. They're quite nice those races. Every hour. And they only take 20 minutes, 25 minutes, something like that. So you could, if you like oval racing too, I've, I've checked it out. You could do this this race and then don't hold any longer after uh, you're done racing jump out of it quit the quit the quit the, the simulator and directly oh, pardon, is it here? directly uh, jump into the oval uh, oval race part with the legend forced uh, forced car uh, and then you can just like drive the whole time in races then you have this one and the oval one, so the road series and the oval series just following up each other. So it's race, race, race. But you can't waste any time after your race. You immediately have to jump. I've seen it I had, last time I had like two minutes, three minutes, something like that, to jump in the race and register. So you don't have much time. It's because the possibilities are, are quite small in the rookies. To be able to race the whole time if you're not directly jumping into the other session yeah, you will have to wait around half an hour which can be nice to you know cool down buy a break drink something Ah, I'm catching up on that fifth guy. Uh, there he is. Hello, man. Uh, yeah, from f over 10 seconds, around 12 seconds to 8. 8 something and 4 rounds. Uh, I'm not gonna catch him. If I drive my A best, I can end that. Five seconds from the guy now. Uh, I'm still in the low fifty five, so that's quite okay. Almost done. Survived it pretty well. Yeah, yeah, five seconds. <laughs> Think he made a mistake. Well, it's almost done anyway. And last corner. I think uh, he will end the race like that in the very last corner. I mean, one more to go. 
white flag boys one more to go I was one <laughs> I thought the race was already done good thing there is such a rule with flags because otherwise I would just have parked my car <laughs> and not know why people pass me no wouldn't be the first time I do something like that but okay now it's the last lap I'm trying my best but the, the gap is too big it's three seconds he really has to make a big mistake I don't think I will uh, counter that yeah okay there we go last corner and the end of the race so all in all it wasn't really that bad uh, we got some crashes here and there uh, it happens uh, it's a rookie so after all but if you can manage just to drive safe you can jump pretty quick I think so we'll see for future races if I can get a full clean race without getting bumps by anyone or hitting the pit curbs like I did I'm a master and I'm uh, getting penalties for all stupid things but uh, yeah this was it so thank you all for watching and uh, yeah the next uh, race of the series will be coming very soon so hit that subscribe button so you don't miss it if you want to follow the series and uh, thanks for watching again and have fun racing see you guys bye bye